I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Hey West Ottawa, I'm Danny. And I'm Josh. We have some important information about seniors and upcoming events. We'll be right back. Seniors, graduation is just around the corner. Register now for Jungle by submitting your paperwork and check for $100 to either office. Help is available to pay for Jungle for seniors who need it. Don't delay any longer. Would you like to be part of putting together the yearbook? Those interested in signing up for the annual class must fill out an application. Applications are available in Mr. Trenick's room A171 in the North Building. If you have a question, please email Lisa, Clem, or Mr. Drenick. One of the best senior events is coming soon. Senior Oscar Night will be held on May 10 at 6 p.m. The event is open to anyone. Admissions are a donation of $3. Come watch as awards such as Best Smile, Worst Case of Senioritis, Most Likely Win the Lottery and Lose the Ticket. Many more are distributed to the senior class. There will be many fun performances, MCs, and presenters. Hope to see you there. What's up, Well, I went around school asking nominees how they felt about being nominated for Senior Oscar Night. Senior Oscar Night will be on May 10 at 6 p.m. Hope to see you there. Um, I don't really know why people nominated me, but... How do you feel? Um, I'm pretty icy, pretty... I don't know how do you feel about your current administration? Uh, I mean, Tyler Chow has been a decent class president, but... I mean, I definitely could have done a better job. Uh, I think he's lacking in a lot of different areas. So, I mean, we'll see what the students uh, decide. You're nominated for most likely to be called mom or dad. What are no, your thoughts? No, I'm not. Stop it. That's nice. What are your thoughts? Uh, I'm gonna cry. It's kind of weird that I'm like the second youngest person on staff and I'm your mom, but I'll take it. And I love all of my children. And for most likely to be confused with a student, how do you feel? Young. Oh, gal. I It's an honor, but honestly, it's the old lady award, isn't it? I mean, let's be honest. What are your thoughts on most likely to cheer up your day? I think it's great. <laughs> Tyler Chow, how do you feel about being nominated for next Einstein? Um, for the first time in my life, I don't know. And what do you have to say about Kyle Lance saying he could do a better job as president? What has Kyle Lance ever done in his life? Oh. Is there any competition between you two? Oh yeah, yeah we'll fight all the time. Yeah, we're gonna fight. Yeah. <laughs> You're nominated for two peas in a pod. How do you feel about Hannah? Um, hi, we're nominated for two peas in a pod. Please vote for us. I just met her actually this year. Yeah, right, Dine? Yeah, Dine. yeah. Delaney? Yes, this is Delaney. I'm hungry. We are your hosts for a senior Oscar night. Right, make sure y'all come out and support. It's May 10th. Cheer. There will be a Lynx Night to Shine dance here at West Ottawa on Friday, May 17th from 6 to 8 p.m. It does not matter if you are a Lynx or not. All students are invited to come. The cost for this event is zero dollars. It will be a fun night of dancing, food, and you are allowed to wear whatever you want, meaning dressing up is not necessary. Come out to have a fun time with the links and friends. There will be a Hope College visit Tuesday, May 14th at 9 a.m. and an Eastern Michigan visit May 15th at 10 a.m. Register in the North Office. Greta made a We Are Well on Brianna Elizondo. Let's take a look. Hi, my name is Brianna Elizondo and I like to travel. I've been to Badlands National Park, Mammoth Cave National Park, and then I've also been to national monuments, monuments like Mount Rushmore and Muir Woods. I've been to Costa Rica, Aruba, France, the United Kingdom, California, Kentucky, Florida, Hawaii, and then just other states around the country. My most recent highlight from traveling is we went to the Badlands National Park and we saw hundreds of buffalo and I got to spend more time with my grandparents. 
My most fun thing to do while I've traveled is I went surfing in Hawaii and I also went zip lining in Costa Rica. I like to travel with my mom a lot because we get along really well, but I also like going places with my friends. I've been to California twice with a few of my friends and then Costa Rica was really fun because it was a school group. My favorite place I've traveled to was France because we spent a couple weeks in Paris with my grandparents and we also got to see the Notre Dame, the Eiffel Tower, and eat a lot of good food. This summer I plan to travel to Ireland to visit my sister and then also spend a week out in Colorado with my sister. I definitely see myself traveling more in the future, especially with my family. And my sister right now is living in Ireland on a one-year visa, so I plan to do the same thing as her and just travel to different countries to live there. Congratulations to you West Ottawa High School vocalers who have been selected by Blind Audition to perform at the Michigan Youth Arts Festival on Friday, May 10th at Western Michigan University. Yearbooks are here! If you have ordered a yearbook already, you'll be able to pick it up at 7 a.m. on May 13th in Mr. Drennick's room, 171 North. We will stop handing books out five minutes prior to the first hour, and we will not hand books out during class. You may check at either lunch and pick one up then as well, and after school until 3 p.m. We will continue to hand books out each morning before school all week. If you have not ordered a yearbook but would like one, we do have a few extra books that we will sell for $75 cash only until we run out. Attention all students, the second floor North High School Northeast hallway will be closed starting Friday, May 3rd due to AP and IB exams. Please seek an alternate route. Only students taking exams will be permitted to enter the skier test area. There will be no Wopong on May 9 due to tulip time. If the parade is canceled and we have a full day of school, we will still meet. Well, that's all we have for you today, Well, Stay saucy, Well.